In this lesson, we're going to work on writing decimal numbers in words. Now, there's a three-step process to follow. Uh, number one is to write the number to the left of the decimal point in words. And so, starting with this first example of 7.9, number one says to just write out the word 7. Number two says write the word and in place of the decimal point. So when you see that decimal point, you say and and then write the number to the right of the decimal point in words followed by the place value of its last digit. Well, there's only one digit here in 9, so we would just say 9. And then what place value is that in? Of course, that's in the tenths place. So 7.9 is properly said as 7 and 9 tenths. Okay, so let's follow this procedure for 423.718. So we would write out the number to the left of the decimal point. That's step one. So 423. Remembering those hyphens whenever you have a tens place followed by a ones place. So 423 and, using the word and for the decimal point, now we have to just say or write out 718. So let's do that. 718. Okay, 718, but then we follow it by the place value of the last digit. Looks like I just ran out of room here, so forgive me. I'm just going to go right down here. So 718, and we are in the thousandths place with that very last digit, right? Because this is tenths, this is hundredths, the 8 is in the thousandths place. And so that's how we finish up this number written out in words. All right, now in this next example, notice that there's just a zero in front of this decimal point. Now, to write out a decimal properly, you should always put one zero to the left of the decimal point if there is no whole part. But when we say it in words, we're not going to say zero and um, 5,678 ten thousandths. We're not going to do that. Just start uh, with, the, with really step three. So if this is a zero to the left of the decimal point, just skip steps one and two. So we're just going to write out 5,000. Ten. Thousands. And we say ten thousandths because this is the tenths, this is the hundredths, this is the thousandths, this is the ten thousandths place that that, uh, that that number has its last digit in. Alright, so then finally we have uh, this last one here. We have 25. Oops. Helps if I spell 20 correctly. There's a W in there somewhere, right? So we have 25 and now there's a zero here, right? So you don't you're not gonna say the zero as part of the number. You just look if there's a zero there, you just skip over and just call this 34. So we're just gonna say 34. 30 Four. But of course, 34 what? Well, this is the tenths place, hundreds place. It ends in the thousandths place, so this would be 34 thousandths.